All right, believe it or not, hurricane season, who wants to talk about that, begins in less than 95 days. But it could begin earlier if a committee has its way. So they say storms are developing earlier, which preparedness needs to start sooner. Meteorologist Candace Campos is in studio breaking down the details for us. Candace. Well, Matt, next month, the World Meteorological Organization will be holding its annual Hurricane Committee meeting. Now, during this session, weather officials decide whether or not to retire storms from the previous year. Also on the agenda, this one's sparking a lot of conversation. Forecasters will be weighing the pros and cons of moving up the hurricane season start date from June 1st to May 15th. Now, over the past decade, we've seen about eight tropical systems develop in the Atlantic. Since 2012, at least 20 direct deaths have occurred from these out-of-season storms and have caused about $200 million in damage. Now, the eastern Pacific hurricane season, that already begins May 15th. But whether or not the season starts early for us, the National Hurricane Center will be doing something a little different already for this hurricane season. They will be issuing their tropical weather outlooks. That's what this kind of looks like with the yellow, the orange, and the red, highlighting areas of concern with low, medium, and high concern. This will also be starting on May 15th. Now, their committee meeting will be held on March 15th. We, of course, will let you know of any big decisions that could be coming out of that. Back to you.